Hey guys, Uncle D here. I'm up in Golden Ears Provincial Park. I just climbed, I walked for a couple hours. I got here a little late, so I'm not really where I want to be, but uh, I walked for about an hour or so. And I heard this creek, which is over there. I thought it was the uh, Gold Creek, but it's not. But uh, I found a whole bunch of rock here, and I figured I'd come down and check it out. So anyway, it's starting to get late, so I figured I'd set up camp, up camp. So this is what I come up with for my nighttime shelter, my pack. See, sleeping bag and everything. It's not watertight, but you know what? It's not supposed to rain tonight, so should be all good. So that's where I'm going to sleep tonight, and uh, I'll show you around a little bit. So there's a little water source right up here. I can make coffee in the morning, right there. And it disappears underneath the ground somewhere. But that's pretty fresh water, that's glacial water. And then uh, this is an old dried up creek bed. So I think early in the morning when I wake up, I'm going to uh, metal detect this area see if there's anything kicking around and uh, if not then I'll continue my journey well my hopefully I'll get to uh, Gold Creek and it's actually that way still I gotta climb way the hell back up that way get back onto the trail and follow it down probably another hour hour and a half walk or maybe even two hours down the trail and then I'll come to the spot where I want to be but I got here late and as I said you know nighttime's coming so I figured I'd find a spot and I heard the water down here so I figured that was the creek but it's just another little creek but it should be good yeah it was fairly easy climbing down there might be a little hard climbing up tomorrow but I'll be a little lighter, some of my food's gone already, so imagine I'm going to eat again before I sleep. But yeah, this is my next gold adventure, guys. I hope you enjoy it. I know I am for sure. It's beautiful out here. It's so quiet, I can't hear a soul, I can't hear traffic. I hear a plane, though. So this is uh, Maple Ridge area outside of Vancouver. This is where this is. But yeah, I should be able to get, get some killer shots with my high definition camera. So, when I see something cool or I find a little bit of gold or something, I'll uh, put the camera on. Well, thanks for watching guys. I miss you, my family and friends. Peace out. Well, good morning. Uh, this is day one. Uh, last night was awesome. Slept like a baby. Uh, it's just beautiful out here. Uh, no rain or anything. Temperature never dropped. It's pretty good. So, it's about 8 o'clock in the morning. I finally got my ass out of bed, had a coffee. And now I'm going to start metal detecting this area. See what I can find in here. And if it's no good, I'll move to another spot. No big deal. But, uh, yeah, I guess I better get started. This is the, the Gold Bug Pro metal detector. It's pretty good. Runs like a champ. It's easy to set up easy to use, works quite well.
Yeah, this thing weighs like two, two pounds, two and a half pounds. It's pretty awesome. I'm not sure if you can see this here, but we'll turn it on. Yeah, she's ready to rock. Let's see if we can get any signals. I had a signal here, but I lost it. Must have been a false one. Oh, just keep looking. Uh, I don't have too much battery time, so uh, I'm going to keep going with this, and uh, when I find something good, I'll turn the camera back on. Oh, hey guys. I kind of metal detected around here. I didn't get any signals, but I went way down there, and there's a nice little creek down there, and it's got a bunch of magnetite in it looks pretty good so I've got all my stuff on here I got my day pack got my metal detector my gold pan shovel and uh, whoa. and I'm on my way to that creek looks good doesn't look like it's been touched by man at least not in the last hundred years anyway but I figure I'd show you the journey down it's pretty cool all that brown rust that's all iron which is what you want to look for there's tons of granite here I mean tons of granite everywhere you look is granite which is a good sign for gold too it's all good signs sorry for the camera guys
Yeah, I just left my stuff up at the campsite there. I think I'll stay there tonight again because it's so comfortable last night. It's pretty awesome. Good sleep. Didn't really want to wake up this morning, but I had to get up and get going. I've only got till Friday. So, oh, got to jump down here. So I want to make the most of it. Trying to keep the camera as steady as I can. Oh, all caught up here. And whatever I climb down, I gotta climb back up. That's not that bad. Pretty stiff for not being out for a while. Probably hear a few old man grunts and groans, but it's all good. Slow and steady, that wins the race. So I'm about a, about a four hour drive away from Kamloops, down close to uh, Vancouver. I'm not sure if you ever watch the news, but if you watch the BC weather news, you'll, you'll see Surrey and Maple Ridge and, and all that. And then you'll see a line of mountains where the mountains start. That's where I am right now. I got a buddy picking me up on Friday. So I've got Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, four full days to look. And then Friday I'll just be getting back to the main gate. I haven't seen any bear scat or anything like that, so that's kind of nice. But there are bear out here, cougar. I don't think there's a grizzly here, I think it's just black, black bears around here. I'm not sure if some of you guys remember uh, the gold panning trip I went on when I lost my kayak and everything, got stranded on the Greyhound. Well, this is basically the area I wanted to come to when I first started with all this stupid nonsense. I figured I'd become a great gold miner. But yeah, this is basically the area up near Pit Lake. Shoe Max Gold. Oh, wouldn't that be nice to find that? That would be something sweet. We're almost there. wiped out. Logs are all wet and slippery. No chance in catching anything on fire here. Everything's wet, damp. So 
supposed to be a nice out all week though. But it's according to the weatherman, whether you want to believe him or not. Oh, should be good. Should be good. I think you can start here in the creek now. There she is. It's pretty sweet, eh? Well, when I find a spot where I'm going to dig, I'll put the camera on and uh, see what we can find. Hope you enjoyed that journey. Well, hey guys. Well, I made it down to Gold Creek. I'm on the actual creek right now. That's the mountains up there. Still snow. That's so awesome. How beautiful that is, eh? Wow. So, I, uh, you see those big rocks down here? I went and dug in behind that one, uh, freedom behind that one, those couple there, kind of went around the corner, there's nothing there. All that's here is just granite, lots and lots of granite. That's the trail back to my campsite. That's the actual trail that the people take. It's not what I take. But anyway, I just wanted to show you this. So there's no gold here, at least not here. There's no black sand. So I'm gonna try to get up to there. You can see a little bit of waterfalls there. And there's a whole bunch of big rock. See what kind it is and see what we can do. When I get there, I'll uh, film it again. Oh, it's just so nice here. I just wanted to show you where I am. I haven't got eaten by a bear yet, so that's good. But yeah, so I'll head over there. I'll see you when I get there. Well, this is the next spot I'm going to try. It's a lot different kind of rock here. And there's a bunch of bedrock poking out all over the place over there. I just have to figure out how to get across. I want to check out over there. And I'm going to do this inside bend where I am right here. Well, that'll detect this. See if there's any black sand. And then I'll work my way down. Just wanted to show you. If I find anything good again, I'll put the camera back on. Peace. Well, I made it to the falls. This is called the lower falls. I'm gonna metal detect this area for a little while. And then work my way back down the creek. So nice, eh? Look at that. So there's another set of falls farther up which I probably should have packed up and went up there today, but I'll do it tomorrow morning. I'll get up nice and early and pack up and head out. But 
I'm gonna metal detect all this now. And see what I can find. If I find anything good, I'll definitely put the camera back on. Sun just a shining. Pretty cool, eh? Anyway, that's all for now. I just wanted to show you this. Show you how beautiful it is. That's sweet. Water is just so clean. Hey guys. Peace. Oh, hey guys. I'm part way over. That's where I was. I had to climb through the bush there. There's a real deep pool. But now it's shallowing all out. I just wanted to show you how clear the water is. Isn't it beautiful? Still trying to make it up there. Somebody's been here. There's a cigarette butt. This is pretty sandy. Start to sink a little bit in the mud. Trying to hold the camera as straight as I can. Hopefully I'm coming up to a little bit better rock, more than quartz, I mean uh, granite. Man, there's a lot of granite there. Imagine there'd be some nice trout in here. Oh, look at that. Oh, I see gold. I see a plate of gold. And I just muddied up the water. So it should come back. I hope. Where did I see that? Almost positive I see the flake. Unless it was pyrite. Yeah, right there. I don't know if you can see it or not. Probably pyrite. Yeah. Well, let's see what type of rocks here. Okay, we've got a lot more granite. Tons of granite. Further. It is pretty nice and sandy there though, but I want to kind of look for the magnetite, whoever the magnetite is in the creek, that'll, uh, whoops, sorry, that'll uh, determine where the gold will fit. So, anyway, we're going to keep going, and when I see something interesting again, I'll throw on the vid. Well, let's stop for a break. From where the east and west trail meets. I came from that way, but of course along the trail, which is on that side. Anyway, I just wanted to show you. So I'm above the falls you now. I still gotta go another, probably another five kilometers get to the next spot so I better get going. But I figured I'd just show you this. Cool little bridge. There's the trail up there. Of course there's my stuff. 
So anyway, I thought this was kind of cool. So I figured I'd show you. Pretty sweet. Well, it's about 7 o'clock at night. I finally made it to Half Moon Beach. This is Half Moon Beach. So this is where I'm allowed to camp. Oh, those mountains are beautiful. It's going to be nice. I'll take pictures again in the morning. Can't really see. It's just beautiful. Yeah. I'm not sure about the gold thing. I don't see the right colored rocks, but I can go up the creek that way a lot more. So tomorrow and the next day. So I might be able to find something good here. Who knows? That'll be my first fire this year. Be awesome. Oh, there's all my stuff I carried. Oh man, that was a long, hard go. But I'm here. So, I guess I better set up something for camp and collect some firewood and get ready for the night. So, I'll fill my fire though in a little bit. That way you guys can see the fire out here. Oh man, this is ever nice. Look at that rock face, eh? Imagine trying to climb that bad boy. Wow. Well, anyway, this is where I is, and, uh, I don't know, when something interesting comes up, I'll film it. Well, hey guys, it's Tuesday morning. That's all the clouds. And right up in the clouds, 
Looks so cool, eh? Figured I'd show you that. So, my objective today is to head that way. And, uh, I don't know, see if I can find some big boulders or some big rocks that some gold might hide, hide around. But to me, all this looks like is granite. That's it. So, I'll have to go a little farther up. It's quite the journey yesterday, getting up here, but I made it. So, just getting ready to go. Fire's almost burnt out. I'll make sure that's out before I leave. And this morning was pretty cold and damp, a lot of condensation. Everything was just wet when I woke up. A little chilly this morning, but it's all good. All good. Alright, well if I find anything else interesting, I'll throw on the camera. Well, hey guys, this is the next spot I'm going to check out. There's not very many big boulders here. So, I don't know, I'm going to metal detect it anyway. But, I think this trip might be a lost cause. Oh well. Somebody told me there's cold up here, but I don't really see the right rocks. I don't see any big boulders, I don't see any bedrock, it's all granite, but I mean you never know so I'll just keep looking, I still got a couple more days here so might as well figure out something to do with my time, but anyway, I just wanted to show you where I am, I'm almost at the, almost at the clouds, see that, that's clouds up there, that's pretty cool. Well, anyway, oh, I took a took a dunk in there. I uh, went up over my hip waders. There they are drying out, and I'm all soaked. And there's a mosquito on my on my hand. But he's gone. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, this is where I am. If I find anything interesting, I'll turn the camera back on. Well, I wanted to show you how steep this trail is. You can see it's just going up on, I don't know, a 70, 80 degree angle. I don't know if you can see that on camera or not. But you can see how far down it goes. You can see the creek down there. And I've traveled that, so I'm about halfway. Came up from that direction. But I just wanted to take a break and just kind of show you some of the terrain. It's nice though. Nice little seat if I wanted it. Anyway, that's where it is at the moment. Oh hey guys, I left that other spot. There wasn't any really any black sand or anything. So I found this area. Uh, I've seen a bit of magnetite. Uh, ooh, did one pan there. Found a bunch of uh, magnetite, black sand. So this might be a good area. I'm gonna go up in the far corner, and I'm on the inside bend. So right up where. The first tree is there. I'll probably go up in there and check this out. Man, I'm way out here. I'm probably, let me see, first day I traveled two and a half hours. Next day I traveled another couple, three. I'm about six or seven hour walk away from where I got dropped off. But it is nice out here. Thought it was gonna rain on me. I dunked myself in the river, of course. So I'm all wet. Well, I'm drying off anyway. But yeah, I'm almost where the clouds are. That's pretty cool, eh? I 
I just thought I'd show you that. It's pretty awesome. Well, if I find anything good here, I'll let you know. Have a good one. Well, this is where I am now. This is the next big area. See the mountains. They say. There's a little bit more quartz here. A little bit more magnetite. A little bit more other different kinds of rock. Which I'm looking for. So. I came in that way through that little bush. That's where the trail goes. So, I think I'm going to spend an hour or two here and see what happens. And uh, if I find anything good, I'll throw the camera back on. Just wanted to show you where I am. Huh. My camera just conked out for some reason. Not sure why. But, oops. So, here we go again. Got my metal detector in my hands, too. Fairly easy walk through here. There's some parts that are fairly difficult. Not too, too bad. When you start going up and down, like right here, sometimes you get a stretch like this and you're just basically rock climbing. I'm definitely in the outback. I seen a loon earlier. Haven't seen any sign of bears. No sign of deer. It doesn't mean they're not here. Just I haven't seen any any sign of them.
I like that how they just cut it out with a chainsaw. It's pretty funny. It's good though. It's awesome for us. Most of this trail is pretty easily marked, so you know which way you're going. It's pretty simple. Might be a little difficult at night, but most of this is okay. Get close to the water again. There's water down there again. I've been down all on there. Same thing as granite. Not much else. It's fun to explore though. Okay, I'm gonna stop it here. So you get the idea, I guess, eh? It's pretty sweet. Nice place. Nice place to visit. Had to stop and show you this tree. Look at the size of this guy. I'm not sure if that camera's gonna do it justice or not. Well, it's pretty big, pretty old. So I'm just going along the trail again, looking for another spot to check out. It was Wednesday, Wednesday morning. Oh, hopefully today will be a better day, but we'll find out. Have a good one. Well, it's Thursday. This is the last spot I'm going to try. It's a better looking creek. Climbed up from down that way. The creek's running pretty fast, so but there might be a few spots I might be able to dig into. So I guess we'll check it out. Not sure how I'm getting across this.
but most likely I'll have to go over that way somewhere. Climb up and around. I don't know how deep that is. Oh, maybe it's not that deep. I'll figure it out, but I'm not going to film it. <laughs> Probably drop the camera. So anyway, I just wanted to let you know where I am. So, story goes, no gold yet. Uh, hiked all over the place. I've uh, seen a lot of it. Tested a lot of, did a lot of test pans, but not a plate. Not a plate. So hopefully this is the spot. All right, I'm finding it good. Well, I'm back at the parking lot, waiting to get picked up. No gold, waste of trip. It, it was still fun though. It's all right. It's been a long five days, so it's all my stuff. Yeah, it was quite the interesting trip.